going on guys we're going to do a little bit of ben wallace pink diamond ben wallace check-in and some gameplay we also have all the cards we need to lock in for both coaches i don't know if i'm going to do that though so that's what's going on today and then you know some season six prep and talk you know what should we be doing what should we be selling or not selling there's a lot of chatter out there about what season six is going to bring um, there was a leak, potential leak. Maybe it's real, maybe it's not. It looked real. Um, that leak sounds like it's going to be about the glitch cards. So it should be interesting. Should be an interesting discussion today. I hope you all join us. If you're watching this on the replay on YouTube, I appreciate you guys. If you're so inclined, please like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate you all. Love you all. Thank you. going on out there guys how's everybody doing today so I finished off the pink diamond grind it required us to use that LeBron card that I was not a fan of the one good news of the LeBron card though and the use of him is that I have an Evo option to go athletic or post uh, I need a few more rebounds. I want to go post. I'll lean towards a post upgrade because look at all the badges he gets. Look at that nonsense. Looks looks pretty good, you know. Looks pretty good. But there's that. I don't know. I'm gonna hang. I'm gonna hang on off on that because I already have. Um, I already have a couple of different options for LeBron. That you know the nice part about the. That Evo card is that it always looked like something a lot less, right, to the CPU when it does matchmaking. But this card will be better than this in some ways. That one's definitely better. That one's way better. And this guy's badged up and shoot up, so no worries there. But anyways, but that was the cool part is that I got some of the Evos done. As far as our purpose today, here we are. Ben Wallace card. Let's do it. What's going on, Charlie? Dude, that sounded awesome last night. What's up, Big Reem? How's it going, my brother? Yeah, Charlie, you had a you had a pretty big, pretty big day yesterday and pretty big night, man. I'm very happy for you and a little bit jealous. <laughs> That's really rad, man. I'm happy for you. He got raided by was a Carlos store. You got raided by Charlie. What he what he bring like a 900 users. You serious people like stealing your stuff? You know, I should be on the lookout for that too. Maybe we need to start putting a little something in there that watermarks our, our stuff, you know. Um that that might be that might be for the best, you know what I'm saying? It's just uh it's just weird how people do their thing, huh? Hey, what's good, Yvonne? What's up, my guy? He's always around. I love it. Yeah, yeah, Big Ream, Charlie got raided by Carlos, and how many people raided you, dude? What did he bring in his raiding party, like 900? And, and like, have you been following Carlos a while, or do you know him, or did he just randomly pick you and just said, you know what, I'm going to bless this dude today and hook him up because he's got, you know, a channel that's getting going, you know, because I think that's pretty rad, by the way, that you got raided by by him, I think. I think that's pretty dope. 
Coming over here to our premium. Oh, but it goes, we're going to say no right now. Let's get a contract off Michael. Man, what do you guys think? For content, I feel like I should lock. For fun, I feel like I should lock. For smartness <laughs> and and better use of my MT, I feel like I should not lock. Same thing here. Look, we've got we've got all of them. Both 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 of these. I wish there was a way you could like combine this up to make them all sit closer together because it makes a really cool collage. Although some of these pictures are really you know, I know it's supposed to be superheroes, and I am a huge superhero nerd. Some of this stuff looks a little demonic, man. I'm just going to say it. I'm, I'm not a fan of some of the art, and some of the art is just absolute fire, dude. Like, like who was it? I love this one. This one, like, reminds me of X-Men. Um, this one reminds me of, like, X-Men or maybe Superman. Super Luca. Hey, hey, right? There's Zion. Oh, I love that Zion one. This one's actually cool. It's like Spider. Is he Spider-Man? You know? There's, there's Stephen Curry. Uh, some of these are just really cool looking. Um, I really, I really like Yokik too. Yokik just looks like uh, Colossus a little bit. Can you tell I'm an X Men fan. It looks like Colossus a little bit in this. Prior to him armoring up, you know, and then his leg over here looks a little, a little, little uh, elongated too. I don't know. They they did some cool artwork with this. This is is just fire. This reminds me of like Black Lightning or Static Shock. Uh, characters, I love those characters. That's a he reminds me. This is a really good card too, by the way. I'm not sure who I like better. I think I like De Aaron Fox better than D'Angelo Russell, but they're both fire. I actually threw some badges on this one. Um, what did I do with him? Yeah, I got, I got flexible and rebound chaser and dead eye and hot zone hunter. Thought about throwing like green machine on him too or slippery. He also wouldn't do so bad with another defensive badge, but he actually plays some pretty solid defense. Uh, corner specialist wouldn't be bad. I don't know. Have to give me your thoughts on that. Pulled KG and Opal LeBron. Holy cow! You about to get uh, David Robinson there, Avon? Yeah, hundred thousand XP due in four days. Who has a hundred thousand XP left to do? That's a lot of XP. Um, I want to give a shout out. Uh, looks like when we were offline, we had Beast Mode 313 give us a follow. Mad Titan Gaming 34 gave us a follow. Uh, Devolve Gaming uh, gave us a follow. I really want to thank everybody for following and being a part of things. I want to thank my fellow streamers for being in here and being supportive. Thank you guys. I love you guys. I hope you guys get 10,000 blessings on top of the way you, you bless me. I really appreciate it. Appreciate the love and support, man. You guys are great. Um, getting on to things here. Um, I think I'm gonna do a little, little bit of triple threat. Let's let's take a look at this Ben Wallace card. He is fire. I think. I think offensively, I'm gonna hate him, and I think defensively, I'm gonna absolutely love him. And I think his finishing is gonna be decent. He's got a 90 standing and driving dunk. He's got an 86 ball handle, so we can speed boost a little bit. 95 block, 90 speed, or 90 steel, excuse me. 90 perimeter defense, and 96 interior. 96, 96 on the offensive defense rebound. 95 speed. That's phenomenal. Um, 88 speed with ball. Uh, 97 vertical, 95 strength. 98 hustle, 96 lateral quickness. I mean, this guy's gonna be able to defend one through five. I mean, this is fantastic. His his mentals are right there. Um, his attributes, I think his, his defensive tendencies are really, you know, I was expecting better. Defensive tendencies aren't bad, but I was expecting better. Like, hang on. I'm, we're going to get to that in a second. I'm going to try, you know, maybe I'm dreaming. I, I think Draymond and Cat, some of the guys have better better tendencies that are more budget, you know, other budget, Pink Diamond uh, cards. So anyways, getting back to the badges, Acrobat, Lesson. Relentless Finisher, Pickpocket, Rim Protector, Chase Down Artist, you know, Box Out Clamps, Defensive Leader. That's actually a really good one. That that puts him on the squad, I think. Heart Crusher, Interceptor, Intimidator, you know, unless we have Kermit the Frog. I want Kermit the Frog. I mean Kermit. Intimidator, Lightning Reflexes, Moving Truck, Rebound Chaser, Pogo Stick, Post Move Lockdown, Tireless Defender, Worm, Contact Finisher, Fancy Footwork, Fast Break Finisher, Giant Slayer. That is awesome because he's 6'9". So you got a you got a chance you you know if you're going up against seven footer you got a chance showtime and he's got all the showtime dunks downhill that's great for speed he's really going to be fast in the fast break and quick first step brick wall he's going to be great for setting those picks 
See, I like DeMarcus Cousins for setting picks, but he's kind of dated now. This card uh, might be might be someone I could use with that brick wall Hall of Fame. There's something else that I was thinking about here that I couldn't remember if he had it on Hall of Fame or not. Oh, uh, it doesn't look like he has it on Hall of Fame. I was, um, I kind of bunny trailed here because I saw that. I was going to see if he had Break Starter. That's right. He has Break Starter on gold. That's still not bad. Um... That's that's huge for me. Like you get a rebound, you got people really pressing. If that's on Hall of Fame, that, that's all right. He's still not bad. And look at the rest of the defensive badges. He's got literally all the defensive badges. He's got unpluckable on gold and tight handles. Ooh, he he's gonna be a dribble and handles for days. What are his dribble sigs? This this could be an interesting card, guys. Avon, you could do it, brother. Love you too, Big Ream. You got Donald last night, and you got Kermit twice. Avon, I, I mean, I don't know if we could be friends anymore, my guy. I, oh my goodness, no, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm jealous though, but that is awesome. I can't, I, I pulled Donald once, so you know that's cool. But I didn't get Terry Dishinder. I didn't get, um, didn't get Kermit yet, and um, I really want Kermit. I think Kermit looks fantastic on the defensive side and his length. He's another Giannis type. You know, model card. Um, the vaults just seems really picky lately. Um, what platform? You're you're on Xbox too, so I don't know. I was I was working it last night too. Um, oh yeah, dude, it's all love, Yvonne, man. I, I love you guys. I thank you guys, and and I hope you guys are blessed for for all you do for me. I can't believe you got all those those uh, takes there, man. That's awesome. Um, man, it makes me want to come in here to do a little triple threat. And and see what's up. You know what I'm saying? I was in here messing around with Juan Carlos Navarro because that's a really fun card to use. Then we got D Rob, of course, and LeBron James. I'm going to come over here. What's he officially listed as? He officially listed as a power forward. Hold on, let's get Draymond in here because I want to compare him to Draymond real fast. Um, is he listed as as a Center? Whoops. I may need to just search for him because I can't remember if he was primary center. No, no, he's primary center. Let's take a look here. I want to look at these defensive tendencies because Draymond Green is, is special defensively, but his height ruins it. Yeah, look at the tendencies on Draymond. Draymond's, you know, I'm up and down on Draymond. See, I wonder if Draymond, Draymond overall um, will be a better card to run, possibly because of his shooting. Um, but he is a little bit short compared to Ben. But look at Ben. Ben's got a little more skill, a little more rebound. That's the key there is that rebounding, man. I always get eaten alive, and he's a lot faster than Draymond. Mm. What do y'all think? Who do y'all think is going to be better? You think Draymond or Ben Wallace is going to be better? What do y'all think? You know, you don't have to quick sale, by the way. You could leave the extra card sitting and just not open the pack and then save it for later. Uh, let me show you that, Avon, real quick in case you're you're unaware. Um, let me back out of this real quick because I've got, like, some stuff pending. So, like, I got a I got a shack the other day, and he's not worth much NT, so I just kept him up here. Watch. So, see, I got these award boosts just sitting here. As long as you don't open it, it'll sit there forever. And this one too. So I go in, I could pop these and exchange them if I wanted to. I don't think any exchange reward is going to be very good in Season 6, but uh, just because the exchange rewards were really bad this time around. Like, I I wish I could have gotten Schroeder just for fun, but they did us dirty and it had to be original owner pools. And even though that stuff was in the TTO boards, I never saw them. I went up and down the boards several times and didn't... I, I saw uh, Isaiah Hartenstein, but I didn't see Maxi at all. And and I actually think I got Hartenstein too already prior to that. Um, Lou Hudson. Look at everything you got to give up to get Lou Hudson. I started working on it and I said, I'm out of my damn mind. Like, there's no way I'm going to give up this many pink diamonds to get this card. Uh, didn't need a Larry Bird. Um, I don't need this Chris Middleton because I already have the pink diamond rewards Chris Middleton. It'd be nice having Chris Middleton that's a, a buck, right? Um, but I just said no. And then Fournier, same kind of thing, man. I didn't get any of these cards. And then Ricky Rubio, same thing here. I, 
it'd be nice if these cards would come back around and get a, if they didn't say original owner maybe i don't know i'm not a big fan of that but um we'll see anyways i just want to show you that real quick um i feel like trying to get this uh get this kermit <laughs> and and since ben's fast he should be able to hang the tto arena what do you all think Yes, I did see the season get leaked. Just one moment, guys. Oh hey, what's up, Nitho? Um, which which tourney, my guy? I think I'm playing um, Demarcus in in um, that Hoff Comp tourney in the Xbox group, I think. So we'll him and I will sync up and we'll play. Right now, I just wanted to stream a little bit because I hadn't streamed. Um, I didn't stream yesterday, and I didn't stream two or three days ago, so. I I only streamed once in three days, so I wanted to get on this. Look at LeBron getting the rebounds. Let's see what's going on with this. Oh yeah, he's got good dribble sigs. He's got a good layup package. He doesn't feel as fast as I'd like him to though, but he's always around the ball. And this is just an offline thing. Like I say, ooh, he's a dunker. So I could live with this card, I think, and treat him a little bit like a Giannis. Maybe throw some shooting badges on him. He's not going to be as long as Giannis. He's not as tall as Giannis, but he's still 6'9". He makes an excellent power forward. I would not put him at center unless I was really desperate, you know, in a matchup situation. Um, sometimes when they're pulling people out too much, you know, maybe you put a smaller guy on the center, and that way your other big can be in and be involved. But he gets good blow-by animations. That was on me. I didn't time the layup right, as you could see from the, the timing of the, the shot meter. Ooh. There we go. D Rob getting us takeover. See if he can shoot a three though. Ooh, that was that was a smooth uh, release though. Maybe, maybe with some shooting. He has catch and shoot, I think, is all he has for badges, shooting badges. So maybe, just maybe. Um, let's get this over to D Rob, have him shoot that. Cash. I do. I keep getting these darn spam stuff, dude. I don't get it. I'm going to delete that. And I'm going to delete that. I'm missing out on my game here. Delete those. Guess I'm going to have to block it, huh? There we go. And the CPU did not want... Yeah, I do have Nightbot... Um... I did sign up for Nightbot, oh, and I'm not paying attention. I did sign up for Nightbot. I need to just get it all linked in, I think. I, I linked it. Um, I need to go in and maybe turn it on. Um, I need to double check that. Thank you for reminding me, because Gerald Coleman, uh, you know, Rel, he uh, he was telling me about Nightbox. I kept seeing it in there, and I'm like, hey, what's this all about? Ugh. This card is pretty good, man, for like a driving, dunking, defending, rebounding machine, man, at the four. That's a really nice card. It's really nice, man. He's almost like a LeBron without shooting, you know what I mean? Hmm, this is interesting. Because, you know, if y'all know me, you know I like to rim run, so this is an interesting card. Let's see if he could post hook. Yep. Thanks for being in, Big Ream. I just need to get Nightbot running. Nightbot would fix everything. There's a chase down. Hmm. Oh, you think I'd win in the in the tourney, Brody? 
I don't know. I have up and down games, man. I have games where I play, you know, like a comp player, and then I have games where I play like a very average casual. So I don't know. It depends on how tired I am. Depends on if I'm distracted. Like if there's stuff going on, you know, with within life at the time, you know. It, it varies. Who chase down? Thank you. Will he shoot it and make it from there? Oh nope. Yeah, he, he needs a shoe, a coach, and uh, some badges to shoot, I think. I'm going to kind of look into that here and see what he can get. Hey, he hit that one on a little little quick stop, huh? But again, this is offline. I would not trust this card to shoot for me online or in a comp game, that's for sure. And that, and that may be what keeps him out of my lineup. I... Um, I like the idea of this card because he's, it's Ben Wallace. I've always been a Wallace fan, and oh man, he just goes inside on people. He's got that Hall of Fame Giant Slayer. Mm. Pro Touch is activated. What else got activated? I'm just haranguing people with defense here. Intimidator was activated there. Oh, he's a nice card. Yeah, new season tomorrow. Uh, supposedly it's going to be glitched glitched uh, theme so that that'll be uh, very very interesting my prediction is a glitched uh, Ben Simmons and Giannis and I could see them giving us Giannis see my I've heard other streamers say that you know Ben Simmons is going to be the reward level level 40 reward that's possible um, I could see Giannis being level 40 reward and a lot of people argue with me on that because Giannis makes some money, but remember last year they gave us a spotlight pink diamond Giannis and it ended up being the best card in the game for literally a month. Remember, you had to go through the Kareem Abdul Dabar spotlight and, and you got your your uh your card and it was part of the bigger collection to unlock Brandon Roy. So that that I thought was pretty cool. I'm just banning these bots, dude. <laughs> What's going on, Delpeca? How you doing, Brody? <laughs> so what's good with everybody? Hey, thanks for the follow, uh, Delpeca. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate you, my guy. But yeah, we're just kind of checking out this uh, Ben Wallace card. He he was fun. He was fun. I think he needs some some shooting badges, and he needs a shoe to help him shoot a little bit. Um, I'm gonna try throwing him in a lineup maybe and go online with him real quick. Anybody else get their unlimited reset? I'm really glad that I already had my uh, my Maxwell card and had my unlimited done for the season. You know, if I was grinding last minute, I'd be pretty upset right now. Oh, the vault. Yes, that's right. Let's see if we can get some love out of the vault. Let's see if I get as lucky as Avon. Avon said he pulled Donald and Kermit twice last night. I'm very salty about this. I want my love here, Kuke. Where's my love? I want Kermit. I already have Donald. I want Kermit. Mm. Thousand MT is cool, though. I won't hate on that. I won't hate on that at all. Um, hmm. I have this little lineup running earlier that I really, really enjoyed using. Um, yeah, I'd be more inclined to replace him with Giannis, I think. If I went online with him. I'm getting hit pretty hard with these bots, dude. Dang. Actually, I don't think mine got reset like that. I think mine went back to a silver. Check this out. No, it put me in Opal again. Uh, zero, zero. Holy cow, 11 and 0 in Opal. That's pretty wild because before I was sitting at, um, I was either pink or Opal. I can't remember, but I already have Maxwell. But that that's pretty cool. So I'm glad they, they, I'm glad they helped some people out. It's last day. You know what I'm saying? It's last day. Dude, is it normal to have this much bot activity? I mean, I know I don't have. Anything, you know. I 
I got more bots hitting me up than I do <laughs> people. That's crazy. All right, all right. Yeah, they are targeting me pretty hard right now. I've been just banning them and giving them the ban hammer as they come through. I wonder who put a hit on me like that. Damn. That's all right. That's all right. Anyways, I, um... I'm glad that that's reset. That's cool. Um, hey, I've never gone through it twice. Anybody know if I'll get another Cedric Maxwell card that I could just hold on to? Hmm, that could be interesting. But uh, anyways, let's make this the active lineup. Let's get this going here. I don't know. I really... He's like my safety net, man. I really like playing with him. I like having Katie. I love this lineup. This lineup has actually really worked for me. I hate messing with it, but we might have to to go online, so uh, so much as it pains me. Let's go ahead and get, because uh, this is a gameplay video, man. Let's get this Ben Wallace up in here. Delpaca, do I lock or no? Do I lock for these ridiculous coaches or no? What do you say, my guy? Yeah, I don't think I'm going to lock. I, I don't know. I would love to lock... Phil Jackson, for the obvious reasons that he's going to boost my Giannis, I'd love to lock for, you know, uh, pop because of that plus 10 strength. I don't know. It, it's it's just, yeah. I mean, it's a lot of MT to lock in, huh? Yeah, I know. It's one of those things. Here's, here's my theory. So tell me if you guys think this theory is sound. I think that we're going to see maybe some Pink Diamond and Opal coaches come. These might be the only two Dark Matter coaches, but what if we get a coach that's like a plus 8 or a plus 9 or a plus 7, you know what I mean, that we can get in the auction house? That could be better. Like, say, what if we get a, a Mike D'Antoni that's like a plus 8 or we get a Mike Malone that's a plus, line, a plus 9 or a, a Frank Vogel that's a plus 7 or a plus 8? I mean, that that would work. Imagine if they're only like 50 to 100K MT. That's a heck of a lot cheaper, you know, than doing it this other way. In my opinion, what shoes? So he's strictly nah. He's wide open on shoes, man. Ooh boy, oh boy. I could put some Kobe, because um, those are the Kobe defenses. He doesn't need those. I could put shooting shoe on him. Kobe Grinch shooting. That would get him up to seventy nine. Mm, he would go up to like an eighty three or an eighty four with the coach and the floor general, maybe close to ninety. That's interesting. Um, I thought about putting some badges on him, but I think I might just play with him off rip and kind of see how it goes. Because he could use some volume shooter. He could use... Really, he needs dead eye. Corner specialist. Right? He could... I feel like corner specialist is going to be a must for this card. I just don't see myself using this card, though, much. The more I think about it, I got to badge him up pretty heavy. Anyways, we're just going to play it. All right, we're going to play this and see how this goes. Stand by. Let's go into some Unlimited where I'm going to lag like crazy because I still don't have my Elgato. My Elgato still hasn't shown up. Yeah, I'm just coming here and banning these things. They just keep coming in. So you think it'll be weird? Phil Jackson and Pop both have issues. What do they have issues in what way, my guy? My controller's falling apart, guys. I need to get a new, uh... I got an Xbox Elite controller. I need to get a new one. Uh-oh. Cork soakers. It's already kind of, like, lame. Oh, and he's got Giannis. That's just fantastic. Let's go in and see what his squad looks like. Some of the boosts do nothing. Well, that's good to know. He's got a, a, a no money spent squad, huh? Mm, we might be okay. Unless this guy's, you know... Strong player, we should be all right against him. Yeah, I think some of their boosts are going to be foobar in terms of um, cards already being pretty pretty well loaded. You know what I mean? So I think they're going to be pretty well loaded, and you're not gonna it's not gonna benefit. And so I the only <sighs> limited limited gameplay would be nice. You know, be nice to have them for limited. Be nice to roll with that. 
Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to come in here and set up some couple things here. I'll, I'll mess with this hedge later if I need to. And I think I'm just going to roll with this like this. Sometimes I I double and mess around, but that hasn't been working as well for me. I'm not I'm not jumping in on my my uh, defense fast enough yet. I can't quite get my rotations in like some of you guys. I, I need to sit down with with EF and with a couple other dudes and test my stuff out and see see how I get my rotations better. Then I can start getting real real nasty with the traps. Oh, and I don't know, some of you guys are in my tournament chat, some of you guys are not. If any of you guys want in my tournament chat, just comment in here and um, and tell me your real name. Or if you know who I, I really am on Facebook, just message me and you want in on an, on some casual and comp Xbox tournaments, let me know and I'll I'll get you guys going. I'm going to try to run one one casual per month and one comp one per month. And if I get time, I'll run multiple People have been on me because I'm not running these things fast enough. Ooh, look at Ben getting out there. Boom. Ooh, he runs. I love it. See, I'm not saying he is LeBron. A lot of people get freaked out because I'm going to be like, hey, he runs like LeBron, but like he, he's running like LeBron would in terms of he's just always running and getting down the floor. At least I hope that's what he's doing. And if he is, and with all that speed, he'll be fantastic. Come on, MJ. Just dunk over everybody. Ah. Hey, I'll take that animation. That's the old school Michael animation. I love it. Go dunk it, Ben. Oh my goodness. And he's got show he's got takeover already? Oh yeah. He got must have got boosted by that. Oh, go get the chase down block. No? No chase down on KG, huh? Alright, that's fine. There we go. He's got a strong inside presence. That's uh is that Dark Matter Kevin Garnett there that he's he's matched up against. So that's an interesting matchup. Um, you know, arguably the strongest defensive card in the game, right? So that's a good matchup. What's he going to do there? I hate pick and rollers. Alrighty, let's go. Yeah, I'm going to dot that. You double down on my boy, I'm going to dot you. So just let me go and do my gameplay, darn it. I was, I was there. I don't know why it didn't let me get a little more defense out of that. Is he going to jump the lane? He didn't even jump the lane on that, really. And I did not get the animation I wanted. I did not want to shoot that with the stick. Anybody else having weird issues with, like, your settings getting changed for, like, your, your shot stick and stuff? I run, like, a normal, and then I have no vibration just because that works for me better. The vibration actually distracts me. And, um... Sometimes I'll go in and my shot aiming will be on and I don't use shot aiming and all kinds of other nonsense and also uh Yeah, there, there's something else that gets messed up too with it, but we'll see here. Hmm. I gotta check on that real quick. Let me check on that. Shot meter's on, obviously shot aiming's off. Okay, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay. Let's get this over in to Ben. Show him what's up. Go get it, big dog. Oh, he fouled me. Good. Good, good, good. Go to Ben, another bot. Gotta love that. So what's everybody else got going on this morning? Anything good? Ugh, that was ugly. I thought I'd hit that close enough to... Get it in. The reason why I'm using the shot meter, by the way, and I greened that one, is because online I just get a lot of lag. And I have myself in a DMZ and everything else. I don't know. It's just kind of a safe space for me. I might... Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, this guy's got one of those things where I can't see what he's doing with his score.
I really like Maxwell. Everybody's doing okay with energy. Ben Wallace is filling the little because I've been using him a lot. I need to get better on my rotations there. There's D Rob. There you go. And this one too, shall we? Big block, big block. Good job there, Ben. <clears throat> Maxwell getting it done on the inside. Man, Maxwell is fun. Ben Wallace is not a bad card. Not bad if I, you know, think if I put some sh some shooting badges plus a shoe. He looks like he'd get any shoe. That could be interesting. Is that going to go in for me? Of course not. Mm. That's ugly. It's so ugly. Oh, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. Man, I totally screwed that shot up too, didn't I? No chase down for Ben. All right, all right. Might have to get more serious about this. I haven't been... There we go. Little little jumper. There's green dunking on me. <sighs> Not enough time to get another shot off. He's up by one, twenty one twenty. That's no fun. That's all right. I'm gonna sub out. Alright guys, see if we can finish this game out. Love Kevin Durant. I 
I don't know why his his animation stopped. I want to dunk that. There's Kawhi getting the dunk. This guy's pretty decent. He's good enough to beat me, but we're going to try to stop him from doing that. And he got an N1. That's just fantastic. And we'll get Ben Wallace back in here, but he he's serviceable. He's serviceable. I don't think he makes my squad, though. I, I have to think about it. I think a shoe and a badge. I think if you're no money spent, it's a no-brainer, though, to have him on your squad. I will say that. It's a no-brainer. Somebody like him and Cat and Draymond in your rotation. That could be decent. Draymond's undersized, though. Um, but there's purposes for, for an undersized center that can shoot. Ben's just tall enough and long enough to where I think he he'll work, you know. Oh, I gotta start hitting this shot with Jokic. He gets so open too. I should be able to easily beat this guy. He's not playing the passing lanes or anything. There we go. Finally got a three out of yoke kick that we needed. So they're going to leave him open. I'll shoot it with him all day. I'll take that. Take that too. We all tied up still. Yeah, this is just back and forth. Oh, that was a bad pass on my part. Jokic doing work. You get some Ben Simmons in here so we can get more fast break dunks going on. Ben Simmons in here now. That should help me out a little bit. I like Ben's defense too. Can't wait for the Opal to come. I'll take that. KG just annihilated the shooter. I gotta get KG out of there. He's playing a little too aggressive, I think. That's 
uh, get Zion in there for old, uh, Actually, I was goaltending too, so I get an N1. That's fantastic. I'll take that. There we go, finally. Finally getting some steals. You get uh, Ben Wallace back in here, maybe. Try to keep this theme going of the gameplay, huh? This guy's taking his whole time out time. Unnecessarily so, it's not going to help. Game is just one of those games where we're going to be close all the way down to the wire, I think. There we go. A little bit of Kawhi going on. I think we've had Kawhi for a whole season now, and he's still a top-tier wing. I love it. There's a block by Zion. Out of baby. Man, I don't want to take him out, but we're going to take him out to get Ben in here in a minute. My Zion has steady shooter. I don't like that, but I'm keeping it on because it's value. I might resell him uh, to someone, or if I go on next gen, he'll need that badge, right? So, that's just a thought. Huh, did I shoot that with Ben, really? All right, I'll take it. Should not have shot that with Ben, but okay. There we go, I got a good rotation that time. Oh, bad pass. I did not mean to commit that foul. There we go. We got the steal. We got Ben back in. Jokic's going to dot this three for me. There we go. All is well again. I really love Yo Kick when I can hit with him. Well, is he really going to try to pressure defense me? That's not smart. 
No, that's not smart. There we go. You'll kick scores again. Nikolai Jokic is EDM alive. I'm a Nuggets guy, so last thing you want to do is force me to use my Nugget players because you will pay. I've got a Jamal Murray card that's pretty insane. I just don't think the Jamal Murray card is, is it right now, though. We'll see. My Jamal Murray's got Hoff. It's an Opal moment. It's got Hoff clamps. Hoff uh, Intimidator and uh, Tireless Defender Hoff. So it's not a bad little card. I can use him, but he's not ideal. Uh, for some reason, he's just... Let's see if David Robinson's got enough to stop Jokic in the post. He did. David Robinson's such an excellent card. There's KG dotting one on me. Is it all tied up? Ah, oh, he's up one. What you gonna do with that speed boost in a five out, buddy? Unless you're pinching the, the lanes, you're not gonna stop it. I'm not gonna be that much of a troll about it, but I'll do it to win. Let's go with Luca. Let's bring Maxwell back in. See if he can go inside. Oof, so close. I was just curious if he could get some of those weird plays and weird layups to, to go in. How did that guy get that to go over everybody? My goodness. Is the game broken already? Uh, he got. I hate those steals, those lane steals when you try to pass it short. Mm, that's upsetting. And one? No. Sorry, everyone trying to ban all these bots here. Yo, kicks a little tired. Time to bring back in D Rob. All right. Good D, good D. I don't know what I was going to check on here. That's what's hosing me here. We don't want that on. Okay. There we go. I'm getting a little bit of better rotations here. Mm. I did not capitalize on my good D. There we go, D Rob. Thank you. He's still up by two, huh? There we go. I'll take that. One second left. Hopefully we can stymie him. All right, good. Tie ball game going in the fourth. I 
I'm going to try putting in Harden again. Oh, I didn't pull anybody over like I need to. That's my bad. Mmm. Showtime dunk. That's why it's a bad idea to press like that. And he's doing a really hard press. I'm just having a hard time stopping him, though. Who's he getting in? He's getting D-Rob back in for himself, huh? That's fine. I need to get a Luca that has some Hoff clamps and some other Hoff defensive badges. I mean, he has Hoff Intimidator, so that's good enough for now. I backcourted myself. God bless it. I knew that was going to happen. He's got Jeremy Lin coming back in, huh? All right. I think he got five seconds violated and wasn't really his fault. The game's been glitching a little bit on that kind of stuff. Should have taken that shot, but I want something more secure to try to firm up things. Oh my goodness. KG is eating Ben. So I'm going to switch up and put uh, try Zion actually in there just for fun. Luca's getting tired. It's time for Jordan to re-enter. Oh. There we go. For some fouls here. I'm going to try Zion at the four in here. He's against a much bigger uh, matchup with uh, Garnett, but I think we'll be all right. That wide body seems to handle itself. There we go. That's some defense, boys and girls. And I should not have thrown that pass. I did so well with my defensive assignment there, and I threw a bad pass. Hmm. There we go. There we go. 
Take a Zion. Oh, showtime, baby. Showtime me. Now that we got takeovers, we're going to keep Luca in there. Oh, he gets an and one, really. Hmm. There we go. Cash that, Luca. Man, he got by me too easy on that one to tie it up. Oh, and one with Maxwell. I'll take that right on top of Robinson. And who's there on the ground? Who had to be picked up off the floor there? Was that KG that had to be picked up off the floor? I'm sorry, guys. My guy Maxwell had to come in and get this clutch bucket for me. My my bad. <laughs> Oh man, he got a mismatch there with Harden on him. And he gets it. I'm telling you, if you guys haven't done your unlimited, you're missing out on this Maxwell card. Oh man. I didn't get that situated well enough. That's okay. Yes. He's got takeover, so he's going to get to the hoop at will. Honey, green that. That's clutch. That is clutch. Come on, guys, move around. Oh, my goodness. That's just bad for me all around. Bad possession. Nobody wanted to move. There we go. Got some defense going. Good job. Good job. Defense wins championships, they say. I will take it. This is a sweaty beyond sweaty here. All right, just cash the free throws, and we might walk away with the dub. Never know. We just got to be patient here. Sit back, see what happens. See who he's throwing to, see what we could do. And that was a sweaty, folks. We got the dub. Very proud of myself playing for a little bit of defense there at the end. Uh, really can't complain about that. Very happy about that. And yeah, I need to get my uh, night bot going. I had gotten the login going. Rel had told me about it, so I just need to do that for us. So that way we're not dealing with all this. I'm not being distracted during a game. I had to come over here and try to ban out these bots. It's amazing to me. They just... It's unlimited. I wonder why Twitch doesn't... I also have something built in to help with that. Let's see how everybody did. I mean, I wanted to use Ben Wallace a lot, and it looks like I did. I mean, he was my second leading scorer in this game, surprisingly. I did not expect that. I um, I was going to him. I was wanting to use him, but I didn't expect that. He goes inside quite well. Um, that first quarter, he, he really, really did some damage. Um, third quarter, fourth quarter, he just kind of did his thing. Um... Yeah, I mean, if you're no money spent, I would definitely 
get in. Um, his release isn't horrible. I might throw some shooting badges on him and try showcasing that for fun at another time, but that, uh, that was pretty cool, and I just, I can't bring myself to lock for these coaches. I want to, but so much MT tied up. I think I'm going to hold off. I'm going to wait and see if they bring out other coaches. Like I predict, they may not bring out coaches that are as good, but if they bring out coaches that are almost as good and they're cheaper, like less than, you know, 100,000 MT, then, you know, that's that's a much better option. And I'm not saying someone should go and spend 100,000 MT on a coach, but, um, you know, it just seems like that would be a better option. And then my Jokic finally caught fire. I was waiting for Nikolai to, to light up for me out here. Um, Wallace in place of Giannis, I mean, I feel like Giannis, because of his length, is a little bit better. Um, Draymond, see, Ben's going to rebound better than Draymond. He's faster than Draymond. He's going to get to the rim better than Draymond. Draymond's still in, in your no money spent contention, right, because he's a, a relatively cheap card. Draymond's going to shoot the lights out. He's going to play great perimeter defense and interior defense, but he's He's short. His rebounding is really, really tough to deal with. Ben, on the other hand, Ben rebounds. You know, um, I'm going to take a look here at Ben's um, wingspan because I think Ben's wingspan is, yeah, it's a seven foot. Um, it's not bad. I don't know if he's going to get bullied really bad or not by some of the true bigs. He seemed to hold his own just fine just now. Uh, Draymond's got a seven one wingspan. Um... But his rebounding is just better. And it's probably the rebounding badges. Um, if you go and take a look at Draymond, Draymond does not have uh, anything but gold. Draymond's like gold box, and he's gold moving truck. He's gold rebounder and gold worm, whereas um, Ben is Hall of Fame box. He's Hall of Fame uh, moving truck and, and worm and, and rebound chaser. So he's got all that going. It's another reason why I prefer Cat over Draymond if I'm running him, you know, because cause the rebounding, the rebounding is just key. I'm not saying Draymond's bad because I think Draymond is awesome as like a point center, but you got to have other other people around that can really defend in order to get that going for you. Um, no money spent, though. This guy's a no-brainer. Um, I think that, you know, he was worth the grind, especially now that I got the option to, to go ahead and have, uh, and, and we went up against Draymond, by the way, too. We were we're giving him the business a little bit. He didn't play him much. He didn't play him much because he couldn't guard. He couldn't guard um, Wallace. He couldn't guard Jokic. He couldn't guard, you know, uh, uh, Ben. He couldn't guard uh, Robinson. He couldn't guard my bigs. So keep that in mind, too. Granted, it's me playing and another person playing, and they're, they might not be, you know, as as – skilled as as the average person. I don't know. This person seemed like they're pretty good. They're giving me a run for my money. I'm not great, but I'm not bad. Um, but look at that. No points out of Harden, Garnett, and Ball. Um, a lot of assists, though, and steals for Harden. That's always a plus. Garnett didn't get any rebounds, huh? Hmm. Who'd I play Garnett next to? Jokic. And also, I think he was pulling Garnett out with some of his play. Um, I was kind of going through... Uh, Donchick did his thing. Robinson, Maxwell definitely did his thing. Look at that. Mr. Fourth Quarter himself. Mr. Fourth Quarter himself getting that steal, getting a couple buckets, a nasty dunk, um, hitting his free throws. I mean, what's not to love? What's not to love about the Cedric Maxwell card? He is my starting small forward, folks. I don't think that's going to change for a little while. Um, they're going to have to bring me something pretty potent to upend him. Um, hopefully they do, though, because that's what this is all about, is getting better. Kawhi played lights out. I'm really shocked that my Kawhi did what he did. Because um, this guy had a, a squad, man. He had Garnett. Oof, he went off with Garnett, though. He had Draymond. He's got Jeremy Lin. You know, he had David Robinson. So he had some Opals. He had D. Mitch. He had Cat. Uh, D. Lo. He's more of a budget squad. Kyle Drexler. Or Clyde Drexler. Mark Price, Steve Nash. I just don't care for these cards. He can shoot. He can shoot. He can dunk. Neither can defend. He had Giannis. Which Giannis is this? It's a 98 overall Giannis. This is this is that Opal. Yeah, this is that Opal. So he had the 
the good Giannis. So I was up some stiff competition here. He definitely had a squad. Anyways, we got the dub. We worked it out here. We're down by one. Then we were up by one. Then we were, we were tied, I think, going into that fourth quarter. And then we came up with that. Yeah, let's take a look at the scoring summary. Going into that fourth quarter. Were we tied? Yes, we did. I got that layup there at the end to tie it with one second left. How clutch was that? How important was that, huh? And then we just came in here. It was a whole lot of back and forth. His Garnett and Wallace Robinson. He just kept going with Garnett, man. I didn't have an answer for Garnett. He knew what he was doing with Garnett. And Luca, Zion, Zion again. That's where we got some steals. That's that's where we, we ended him up right there. And then we got Luca with a jump shot. Maxwell with that big dunk and a free throw. That was huge. And I think Maxwell also got a steal somewhere in there. And uh, yeah, we'll just, we'll take it. We'll take it, man. I'm very happy with that. See what happens too. We're getting really close to our uh, another 12 and 0 because they reset us. Thankfully, things were um, pretty messed up. Hey, what's going on, Avon? Let me see if I can get away with with playing, bro. Uh, yeah, we can. I, I I can play. I mean, I want to play, but let me see if I can get away with doing it. Let me see what's going on. I was gonna potentially end the stream. Oh, they did give me another Cedric Maxwell card. Look at that, my guy. Look, Got another Cedric Maxwell card. So I'm gonna hang on to that. So that way, you know, that way we have that. Um, I didn't know that you could keep getting that card. Hmm, that is awesome. So if you come here, I just won't open that pack. I'm going to save that pack. Um, maybe they give us a dark matter that I can I can use that for on the exchange uh, in a future season. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, that would be that would be really cool. Because Lou has all this. So, yeah, if they give us a dark matter, maybe that opal will come in handy. You know what I'm saying, my guy? I'm pretty proud of myself. I was able to get the dub while streaming through my Xbox since I don't have my Agato. Yeah, dude, we we did we did good just now. I'm pretty proud of myself. I don't have a lot of people in the stream. Let's see here. Like I say, let me get back to what I was doing here and, and make sure that I'm clear to play. I, um... How you doing on your grind, Avon? I need to get uh, Nightbot going, huh? Let me check in on Nightbot real quick, guys. Um, I thought I had I got him going. I thought I had Nightbot going. And that he was going to run stuff for us. Let me log in. There we go. I'm logged in. Join channel. Um... Okay, I need a mod nightbot, so that's what's up. Alright, let me see if we can do this. Hang on. Alright, we got nightbot in here. There we go. See, I had Nightbot uh, set up. I just didn't turn him on. So, so now that I got him in the channel, I'll have to see if I got to turn him on every time I jump in or not. And that's okay if I do. Um, I'm new to all this, guys. So I, I need I need someone to give me like a tutorial on this stuff. I mean, I'm an IT guy, so I'll figure it out. But I I like um, I like to fast track things because I got a lot going on in life.
And also got some guys here, see if they want to... Looks like a bunch of trades happening in the NBA too just now. That's pretty wild. I gotta catch up on all this trade stuff. You're 6,000 XP away from D-Rob. Is that what you're 6,000 away from? That's that's tight, my guy, if that's the case. You can do it today. You can do it, man. Let's see what's going on. The Bulls get uh, Nikola Vucevic and Alfarik Amino for Otto Porter, Wendell Carter Jr., and two first-round picks. Jeez, uh, Orlando just blew up their squad. Chicago got better. Chicago wants Lonzo Ball too, huh? They got an Aaron Gordon deal on deck in Orlando. And, uh... That's crazy. NBA 2K My Team says the cards will now switch jerseys in the game. Interesting. Um... Wow. The Chicago Bulls. They're on the map now, aren't they? That's amazing. That is amazing. Wow. Glad Nightbot's in here doing his thing. Anyways. Um, shoot, my guy. Let me see. I got multiple things I'm in the middle of. Don't, don't mind me. There's a ton I'm into here. I need to get another laptop running and get my old laptop fixed. your tag, Avon, if you want to run one, brother. I know you're on my friends list here. Let's see who is online. Perry's out there. I need to hit up Perry. Anyways, that's that's kind of a little bit of my thoughts on this uh, on this card. I um I like him. I like him. I'm not. I don't love the card, but I like the card. My safety net though is good old Giannis. He's just a safety net man. I I really dig that card. He gets it done for me, and that's just that, you know. That's right, v -Lone. So we play a little friendly, try to entertain everybody with v -Lone. Since I got everything done that I think I want to right now, I mean, I'd like to come in and do some of these weeklies to get some of these packs and cards, but I don't know. I'll, I don't feel real pressure to do that. Spotlights, man. I really want to grind these spotlights out and finish up. I've done a few. I'm pushing through. You know, I haven't been totally lazy on it, but I haven't really done enough. So we got to get some more of these spotlights done and start collecting these cards. But ultimately, I want uh, Unselled. I want Wes Unselled. I want. I really want John Wall. I think John Wall would replace, in my best lineup here, I think John Wall would... Man, would he replace Lonzo? Lonzo or Harden, maybe? You know, one of those two. We're keeping Luca around and Ben... Until they give us a better one.
Did I spell it right? J-U-N-K-E-V-L-O-N-E. -E. It, it pulled you up, too. I kind of went past it real fast. I didn't mean to. Huh. Xbox needs to fix this. I've been having a hard time finding peeps lately. You see that, right, Yvonne? I'm having a hard time finding you, guy. Yeah, but it's not even pulling up your tag right now. J-U-N-K-E. Yeah, you're not on here, man. I can't get you. I sent you a friend request too, so it would be easier for us to play later. I don't know if you, there you are. Ugh. Why isn't it pulling you up? It like pulled you up for a second, and then it then it booted it off. I'm gonna just scroll through. There you are. Now I got you, my guy. I sent you a, a, an invite. Okay. And then I gotta play some, some tournament games, so I probably won't stream those just because I get lag on those. I can't wait for my Elgato to get in and then I can start streaming, you know, all the all the fun stuff. Cool. 
No, my tournaments are free. Let me know if you want to get in. You can uh, you can message me uh, your real name. If you don't want to put your real name in here, um, you can try messaging me on, on YouTube. Or you can try, just whisper. Whisper to me on here what your real name is on Facebook. And then I'll add you in. And uh, the only thing that we require is that you join a couple of our groups. And that you like and follow this channel on the YouTube, which I think you already are. Uh, hopefully you're following the YouTube as well. And then you can come in and play with us, my guy. All right, so should we do Hall of Fame? What do you want? What settings do you want to do? Hall of Fame, Superstar. I, I like Hall of Fame, Superstar. Um, let's do Hall of Fame. Five minutes, four minutes. Do four minutes, do a quick one. Probably work in, in somebody else's favor though, like the momentums. I find that when we do four minutes, the momentums don't always shift the way they should. It's always like the person who gets the second momentum swing ends up winning. I'll say that much about the the four minute uh stuff, but I just I just don't want to run run a lot of time with these because I got other tournaments to jump into, brother. Look at that lineup you got, man. Such a, oh you got Kermit. Kermit's gonna be tough. Hermit's going to be tough, dude. I did half four minutes. Sorry about that. I just now saw your message. I love your pick of Shaq as, as Thanos there. That's hilarious. Says you left the match, Brody. You having network problems today? Or is it Xbox problems? Shows are still in there, so let's try again. See what happens. Yeah, that was weird. The fact that you're still in the party is just a, it must be a 2K thing. I think 2K is still kind of kind of trying to get there with their big update that they're doing for season six. Offenses set here. I don't do anything extra special, folks. I just play the game best of my abilities. I'm a trainee, a work in progress. Let's make sure that's off. I don't know why that keeps turning on on me. I might turn off these sliders too for the help defense. 
Try to keep people home. We'll see about that. We'll see about that. Meanwhile, let's go over here to camera options. Can you hear me? Why is it picking it up here? Are you in, in the chat, bro? Like in the Xbox chat? You know, that's weird that it's that's weird that it's picking it up because I have this thing set, I thought, to where it was muting that. Um, or maybe it just mutes you going. That's weird. I, you know, I'm going to go check on that. You keep running with this. Let me know if it cuts out. I want to check on something in the Twitch side. I hope it doesn't. Cut us off. Cause that's fine. All right. You're still there. All right. Oh, okay, no worries, let's, uh, hey, yo, yo, what's good, do you love gaming? I'll send you a message here, get you going, guy, no worries. I wonder if I'm still coming through on the chat, too, for the stream. Let me, I'm going to check on that, too, while we're talking, so you might get an easy bucket here. So I need to make sure. Well, I just want to make sure everything's working. Yeah, it's working. So hang on a second. All right. Oh, did you backcourt on purpose? Or was that accident? All right, well, that worked out because I wasn't ready. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I didn't hit that. Hmm. Hard and strong on here is what I've noticed. Is that uh, the dentist? Oh, that's Don. I I think he should be better. He was fire when he first dropped. And then my guys. He's supposed to be a D-Rose clone, but he don't play like D-Rose. Like he has D-Rose animations. He has D-Rose animations, and he has good badges and stats, and he has a great release, but I have not um, been able to cook with him. I could cook with him offensively, but I can't defend. How about that? And then I'm having problems defending people with D-Rose, too, and I have people, and my boy Rel is like, dude, you crazy. He's like, I chase down block people with D-Rose, and I'm like, I'm not I'm not having that kind of luck. But again, again I'm, I'm on Xbox. He's on PlayStation, so I don't know. Like, we'll have to see kind of what we see, you know. Um, Yeah, I threw I threw Giannis in there with the forks. You who you run at your five? You got uh Mikhail and then you got Yeah, dude. No, you're gonna love this Robinson car, dude. He's he's second to none. He's better than, than Garnett, dude. Garnett might be a little better defensively, but I don't know. David Robinson is pretty tight, dude. Oh, I hate these animations too slow on the catch and shoot. Kermit the Frog. Huh. It, it'll be just they'll cancel each other out is what'll happen. That's that's how that goes. They just cancel each other out. KG should be enough to handle handle Giannis and vice versa. It's um uh, Yeah, man, I'm so ready for the new season, Dev. It's, uh, it's going to be fun, man. The glitched 
glitch, a season of glitch cards, right? So that should be a lot of fun. I'm hoping we get point guard Ben with three-point shooting. I'm hoping we get point guard Giannis and point guard LeBron. Those are my three favorite point guards from last year. I really enjoyed using them and just destroying people. That out-of-position LeBron last year was fire, except for his, his layup animations were my only complaint um, with that card. Oh, my goodness. can't believe I missed that point blank. Green beaned it. Look at you. He, he's got a quick uh, jump shot. I really like him. Yeah, Garnett's not going to hang with Michael on the perimeter. Your best bet is try to get a chase down when he blows by you. You know what I mean? Nope. I gotta pinch this five out. You're running a little better. Slow it down. Yeah, man. Assuming that they they do uh, things, Dev, that I think they're gonna do um, with the, with the positions. You know, there's no guarantee. Nothing's official. I'm just assuming that they're gonna do these different cards because they are big money draws for. Uh, out of bounds. Okay, good. It's a bad pass on my part. But yeah, I'm, I I think that we're gonna see several Giannis's come. I think we're gonna have one that's a, a a reward of some kind, and I think we're gonna have another one that's in packs. And if I was a betting man, I'd say they have like a either a power forward center opal that's in packs or not in, or not in packs, but that's like a, a, a spotlight or something that we could get or reward. And then the point guard one will be in packs, like they did last year. Absolutely they are. Him and LeBron. LeBron's going to break things, and Ben will too. Um, mm-hmm. I am salivating at that prospect. Thank you, James Harden. It, it was. He was a great card, and then so was his NBA's back card. That was a good one too. Michael does his thing once in a while. He's inconsistent though. I must I must gripe about this card. This is this is like my goat of all goat. I love Michael in real life and I think that this card is is really cool and they did a they did him right, you know, by having him be so OP, but it's inconsistent. There's there's games where he's he's, you know, walking on water. He's the black cat, right? Remember that was his nickname, Reggie Miller. Do you, do you did you uh watch uh Oh gosh, what was that documentary um, last year? The Last Dance. Did you watch that and the little story that Reggie Miller told? And there's a little more to that story when when he was a rookie and he was like, "What? He ain't he ain't Jesus. He don't walk on water, you know." Like he's like, "You better call me Black Jesus from now on." You know, I remember that he told him after he whooped on him. And so they're like, "Yeah, we called him." What's that? He 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 was. He was, man, at that time, yeah, because cause Reggie was like, after that, we called him, you know, Black Jesus or the Black Cat, you know, and, and then, uh, did you ever hear that story of Kevin Garnett and Isaiah Ryder talking about Michael? Dude, if I get a chance, I'll try to find the YouTube video and send it to you. It's hilarious. So, they both tell this story at different times. They're on two different uh, shows, and they tell this story, and so, so anyways, the way it goes is, uh, it's, I think it's the rookie year for uh, Garnett, maybe, and Isaiah Ryder, I don't know if you know who that is. He he's a, he's an amazing baller. He slam dunk champion. I mean, he he was he's a baller, right? And like Michael, Michael knew better than to get too crazy with him because he knows that guy could could do a lot. But you know, Michael's always still better. But he showed a lot of respect. Anyways, they always had a good relationship. You know, they'd always hang like twenty or thirty on each other and just kind of go about their business without much talk. Well, there was one game. And uh, Kevin's like, yeah, I ain't had no sleep. He goes to my hometown, Chicago. He goes, we go in there. He goes, and I'm just on fire. He goes, and so is, so is Isaiah. He goes, we're, 
we're just destroying the bulls he goes you know i got like 25 he goes isaiah's got like close to 30 he goes we're getting into the fourth quarter he goes and i just start going off i'm like he can't guard you he can't guard you just give it to him and isaiah's like all right just calm down you know he's like i'm trying to get kg to calm down you know how kg just gets hyped right and uh he's like oh dude and he just went off and like He's like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Michael says like that. Michael's like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And he's like, hey, Mike. You know, Isaiah's like, hey, Mike, he don't know the rules, man. Like, you know, he's like, he's like trying to calm it down. And he just, Michael just gets on that like one leg and he's kind of looking at them both, stares at him for like a good 20 seconds. And Isaiah's like, what are you staring at me for? I didn't say nothing, you know. And and uh, he's like, all right, all right, yeah, I got you guys. And, and KG was like, you see what it did to me here? It didn't even let me see my thing to do my shot. Um, but like KG's like, I can't even describe like the next six minutes of play. He goes, he goes, it was a two point game. Next thing I know we're down 18. He goes, we got three, eight second calls. He's like, it's, it's really bad. He's like, you know, Michael went from having like 10 points to like 32. He's like, we're, we're coming off the sideline. I'm like, Oh my God, my, my bad. He's like, it's all right. He's like, you know, when you go to the huddle, he goes on the sideline, you're like, ah, ah. He's like I'm really sorry. I'm sorry, Isaiah. And he's like, I, I told you to shut the fuck up. It's all good. It's all good. We'll be okay. And they're like, <laughs> it was it was hilarious, man. I was dying. Dude, you gotta you gotta hear KG tell though, because he like mimics everything. And then and then Michael comes up to them on the bench when they finally get benched, because Flip Sanders is the coach. He's like, Alright, this is over, you know? And he's like, You done, you done? Michael, this is Michael talking. He's like, Young fella, you done? You done, you done. And I was, dude, I was dying. I was dying. And they were just like, you know. No. And he was like, yeah, I was, I, I never, I never talked at Michael again. You know, he goes, I learned, learned my lesson. He goes, I didn't talk at Michael again. And, um, and what's cool though, is like, they asked Mike, like that same day, like, what do you think of KG? He's like, oh, he's going to be a good one. And like, they said that when Michael had retired and come back, played for the Wizards, he actually went at KG. He he wanted to guard KG. He wanted to go at him. It was like the ultimate sign of respect, you know. And so there was, you know, and he just said, he's like, yeah, KG's going to be a good one. He goes, he's got on the job training. He goes, he's going to be all right. He goes, but yeah, they were like, you know, KG was like, yeah, I put in 30 on Pippen. He goes, JR is giving it to Michael. He goes, and then and he's like, Michael got mad. He goes, and that was that. He goes, but, you know, I didn't know. I didn't know you don't talk. You don't talk to Mike. Like, you don't. And then that's what JR said. JR was like, yeah, you just. You just don't talk at Mike, you know, like he's gonna he's gonna give it to you. But yeah, there's a, a huge documentary on it. Um it's about an eight or ten minute video. Yeah, this one guy does a really good job because he combines both of the interviews together. So that way they all come together. And and you know it's a real story when both guys are telling it at two different times and it's the it's the same thing, right? And uh the other the other thing that I liked about it too was um this guy like adds highlights from the actual game. So you see you see what he's describing, like you see Michael you know, with his hands on his hips, you see, you see Kevin Garnett doing his thing. Then you see Michael like stealing the ball six times. I remember, I didn't watch the game live, but I remember being a teenager and I remember seeing the game on Sports Center where they're like, "Yeah, here's Michael Jordan just going, going, going off," and we're like, "Geez, he's stealing the ball like three different times on the inbound." Yeah, he stole the ball three times. Like they had more than three eight-second calls, by the way. They had well, they had three eight-second calls, and he also stole like two or three of the inbounds too so they had like six possessions he goes yeah we hadn't scored in like four or five minutes he goes he goes we couldn't do nothing and it was just michael michael was by himself just running across the whole half court taking the ball away it was crazy man and he could do that when he wanted to like he got mad enough he would do those things it, it's wild dude oh that's some good move from kg my guy you know what? I need to call a timeout. My guys are tired. I've been talking too much, not paying attention to the game. Yeah, I love this night bot, man. This night bot's getting it done. Dude, that's hot. Who do the Nuggets give up? Because the Nuggets are my team. Please give me the detail. Uh, I don't. I don't like giving up. I I don't like giving up R.J. Hampton. I think he's gonna be a stud, but, but 
that's uh, that's fire, man. That's. It, but but is he really that good? He's talented, but is he a good five v five player? That's that's my my problem. Like he he's talented. He he's gonna dunk. He's talented, but I mean, I think they're going to regret giving rid of RJ. And here's my other problem is uh, Jamal Murray just needed someone to back him up, too, last year in the playoffs. He was having to play, like, you know, 38, 44 minutes. Like, it was bad. Yeah, yeah, he decided he didn't want to go home. Like, they asked him, like, what happened? <clears throat> oh, yeah, when they were down 3-1 to Utah, he was packing his bag. He's like, you know what? I ain't packing this. I don't want to go home yet. He stopped packing. And I was like, yeah, the man decided he didn't want to go home. Like, that's that's how it should be. Man, that was... I don't know why I'm, I'm getting hoed on these drives in and you're not. <laughs> what do you mean you're delayed? Yeah, you're on the west, sir, or you're on the east. Yeah, this is turning ugly real quick. I, I hate playing when I'm streaming, though, to be honest. I get really frustrated. In case you want to know why I'm so hesitant to play, I I get really frustrated. Um, I don't like playing like this because I'm streaming off my Xbox, so little TTO isn't too bad. Some some showcasing just to make content is, is all right, you know? Um but otherwise, but otherwise, it just makes me look bad. It makes me look like a bad player, and that hurts my reputation. I'm here streaming. It does. Like, I don't... Yeah, but but I... I like to put up my best showing. And I, and I feel like it's not my best showing if I'm playing, you know, like this. That That's what my problem is, if that makes sense. Like, like if it's like... The, I need to get better at my defensive rotations. I'm working on that. And my shooting, I don't know what the deal is with my shooting, why my shooting won't work. Um, see how you're getting the blocks? I don't know how you're getting the blocks like that on me. That, that was CPU? Jeez. Because it's Hall of Fame. That's why. That makes some sense. Mhm. Mm it's a lot of work, man. I'm glad you're able to get close. So if you, what you need to do is quit playing me after this and go grind because you only got another day left. Yeah, you don't want to miss out on this card. It's a nice card, dude. It'll really, really like you combine him with Garnett, and that's that's a lot of good right there. Mmm. Which Zion hero? I would do the hero so we get the Hall of Fame range. If you if you do it, get the hero. I, I don't know. I I I like Garnett's size, dude. Um, <clears throat> you're not wrong. If you do it, like there's no there's no wrong answer. They both are top shelf cards. If that makes sense. See, that was just all length there. It's their length, having them together. See, I like putting KD at the three a lot for all his size, you know. Come on, Jokic, cash that. That a baby. <clears throat> You're going to have to cash a lot of those because Aaron Gordon's coming to town. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I like Aaron Gordon. He seems like a good kid. I think that he's very, very, very talented. And, uh, you know, I'm just kind of disappointed because the Nuggets are supposed to have, like, a little more. And Gary Harris, too, is kind of a big loss. They gave up their guards to add more forwards, and they're already um, – they already got too many forwards. You know what I'm saying? Like, they got MPJ, they, you know, so I don't know. Maybe what they're trying to do is get things back, like uh, Drami Grant, losing Drami Grant. I wonder who's going to be the starting two. If it's going to be Will Barton now. And I thought Will Barton was the one that needed to go, personally. He's been playing way too inconsistent. Oh, come on, Luca. That's 
That is wild to give you that, huh? I snuck him in on you. <laughs> you you know you know you know how I be with him, right? <laughs> He's just another level of animations for dunking and defense and rebounding. People sleep on this car just because he can't shoot. And you know what's funny is you, you get inside the three, he can he can shoot too inside the three. That's the funny part. That's the funny part. You take a mid-range with him, it's money. Yes, Stuv, I do think we're getting an Opal Kobe or a Dark Matter. That's the other card that, you know, could be could be like a spotlight add-in. I don't I don't know. Like that could be, you know. That could be a spotlight add-in. I don't know. We'll see, Dev. We'll see what we get, man. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, you really putting D Mitchell out there on him? Don't don't do that. <laughs> that's not going to work, my guy. You know that's not going to work on matchups, man. He's going to eat D. Mitch alive. You know what's really funny is D. Mitch eats up D. Rose alive. You show me that. And you know what's, and you know what's funny? And you know what's funny? Ever since ever since that happened, I've been noticing any time I play D. Mitch, he lights me up unless I use Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons is D. Mitch's kryptonite. Yeah, for real. It's like a chess match. <clears throat> You think you think everybody else puts it on him? Oh my goodness, he fell down, really? What the heck happened there? He flopped. What is he playing for the Spurs now? Oh, sorry. Or the Lakers. Ooh, green bean. <clears throat> That's cash money. Ooh, bump steal. Look at you. Well, that turned the tide, didn't it? <laughs> it's Luca, dude. Catch and shoot. Like, I actually like Luca at the two better because his catch and shoot is so good. I don't like Luca at the one. I'll ball handle with him. He'll be my secondary, but his his off dribble creation is not uh, my my specialty. I don't I don't care for it as much. See, there's Ben getting that rebound, man. Oh, I knew better than to make that pass. I knew better than to make that pass. <clears throat> Thank you for bailing me out on my mistake. I really appreciate it. <laughs> you bailed me out, dude. Thank you. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Get that joker. Nope. I made two bad passes. You know what? Now if I lose, it's on me. Mm, that was horrible on my part. Think Diamond Carew show, maybe. They might do a uh, a fan favorite. Get some some guys going, you know. I remember last year those fan favorite packs. They had Taco Fall and they had Carew show. All those guys. I mean Sometimes yeah, I like I like Los. He seems he seems cool. Of course he did. Of course he did. I mean, we had we had point guard Jokic last year. That was actually pretty tight. Who... Yeah, I know. They would need to glitch him. They would need to glitch him, and maybe they're going to do some weird nonsense like that. I don't know what's going on with my players here. They are not where they're supposed to be. He 
he's going to be better, but he's still going to struggle because of his size. Yeah, so I just got to get uh, back in like this, and then there we go. Yep. <laughs> it's just, it's that animation. Once he gets that animation, once he gets that animation, though, it's just that's how it's gonna be, and then he's gonna be there rebounding too, you know. Come on, yo kick, finish that. There we go. I need some fresh, fresh meat in here. I I hate to say it, but Donald got zero chance of checking this this dark matter MJ. I'm just got to keep it real with you. This is not gonna happen. Put it, put him on there, dude. Put him on there, please do. I want to see this. I I want to see Donald try to check MJ. <clears throat> this will be fun. Oh, no and one? No no foul? Oh, that's good. Look at this back and forth battle we have here. His his uh reach is huge. He's got such a big wingspan. He's a Dino Raja clone, you know. I I know it's it's a bad matchup. He's got three inches of height. He's stronger. Ugh, that was ugly. Drexler can dunk, man. In real real life, you ever watch him play in in real life? Drexler? Oh, Drexler could have done that. He was as much of a dunker as MJ was. People people just don't know who Drexler is. Like all the youngins, man. He can he can ball out. I was saving him for you. I'm just letting you know I was saving that. I was like, I know, I know he's going to. And I didn't plan that, but I thought it was fitting that my goat of all goats, and I love LeBron, don't get me wrong. Illegal screen, that is wild. I've been seeing more like travels, legal screens, uh, charges and things in the game lately that just haven't been there before, you know? See, that steady shooter helped. Mm-hmm. No, I don't either. There's a lot of things that are that are broken again. You know, they'll call it features and skill of the game or whatever, but I don't care for it. Um, yeah, I don't know about the steady shooter badge on Zion. I, I, I'm tempted to sell this card and buy another one that doesn't have it, because I know I'll get a lot for this card, because it'll be blinders on next gen, and people will want it, you know? That's a that's a good badge, dude. Oh yeah, it's momentum's, dude. <clears throat> I had some momentum, then you got some momentum, and then I got the momentum again. 
And we did five minute quarters this time too. Ooh, what was that foul? Illegal loose ball foul on me. See, I've been seeing that too. So it gave you it gave you back some love there. Oh, you greened that. Nice. That's good. You need to have those cards that you green with. Yeah, Don is not going to handle him, dude. It's it's the size. Mm-hmm. It's the size and strength, dude. That's that's what that is. Um, this game gives too much love to size, I notice. Yeah, it's horrible that they do that with the size. Yes, it was, man. I thought you had me. <clears throat> Let me look at your lineup again, too. So, like, you've got KG. Keep, I'd keep him. I mean, or do you feel like Zion was out playing KG there at the end? Yeah, it, it's hard to tell. I think I it think depends on who's using the card, too, you know? So MJ did his thing in the fourth quarter with Donald guarding him and my dad. Uh, <laughs> ben... Ben was fire for seven minutes. Look at that. That was in one one half. He did that, huh? All right. Harden did his thing in the first quarter. Harden always starts out strong for me. I think this is my lineup now for, for now anyway. Lonzo, I'm not sure about. I love Lonzo, but we might have to get another point guard up in here. I, I can use him, though, because he's not a liability defensively. Oh, it's okay, Avon. It's okay, Brody. Um, but yeah, this is... I wish I could find another point. Mm. I don't know. And let's look at your squad. So, you, you throw these three dudes on the bench. Okay. Let's... Deontay Eubanks. Darren Fox. This is that pink diamond, Darren Fox. Yeah, that's a good card. That's part of your problem, too, is you, you overwork your, your squad here, my guy. You got them in there too long. You only got a seven-man rotation. You need a bigger rotation. Where's your Giannis at? You used to have Giannis. Did you get rid of Giannis? Good game, bro. Good game. But yeah, I would, I would throw Giannis um, back in your squad, man. And you need, let's see, you got Clyde, you got Don, you got D. Mitch, and you got Fox. So okay, so you got four guards. But yeah, you need another, another forward and big, man. You get D. Rob, so you get add D. Rob to the squad. That'll be free. And then I would keep KG. I would get. Um, Get Giannis back, man. And then, did you grind for D'Angelo Russell? D'Lo may not be bad to try out. I don't know. Did you grind for uh, Kawhi? Kawhi is good stuff. Glad Nightbot took control of things. What happened to Devolve Gaming? Oh, that was your the emotes and stuff, gotcha. So hey, uh Devolve. Um where's the Dev Love? Dev Love. What did you what did you post that the Nightbot didn't like? And is it something I can fix? Like can I tell Nightbot to chill out on that?
So let me see what I can do to get it to allow emotes. Okay, so excess emotes is what it does that for. Let me go options. I'll just increase it to like to like fifteen is what I'll do on the emotes. So I found it. Place here where I could do the spam protection and whatnot. But yeah, that was pretty cool, man. Thanks for the game, Yvonne. That was, that was really good, man. Yeah, Kawhi, Kawhi is tough, man. I have no, no regrets. I mean, no regrets on, on uh, Kawhi. I don't think I used him in that one. I really like this Maxwell card, too. Maxwell's shot is really fast, too, and he plays great defense. says we got four people out there give a shout out if you're still in the stream Yeah, you, you need to finish out the D Rob before it's too late, my guy. He got thirteen hours, fifty nine minutes, just do it, man. He's so worth it. He's such a great card. Um like I say, I might come in here these weekly challenges and mess around with this later, but maybe not. I don't know. None of these cards really impress me that are free over here. These packs would be nice. Those packs would really be nice. Um Let's open up a pack for fun, shall we? Nope, no love on the packs. Gotta love that. Absolutely no love. I'll tell you what, I could do maybe one or two more packs. Let's do it for fun, shall we? No shakes? Come on, 2K? Come on, 2K, couldn't, couldn't show me the love while I'm streaming? That's all right. We've packed quite a few cards over the season, so I'm not I'm not too worried about that. We've got a lot of original owner stuff. Like, I've got a little original owner list of cards. We've packed all of these top shelf cards right here. I have no no regrets on, on my pack openings this year. You always want more. Um, a couple other notables that we packed that I didn't list in there is we packed Paul Pierce, the original owner. We packed Iggy Iguodala, Jeremy Lin. Um, I packed Yao Ming. I got Yao Ming and Jeremy Lin in the same 10 pack. I actually should post that up sometime. Um, I might put that up on the YouTube channel if I could find the video. I'd, I'd clipped it and put it into, uh, and I put it into my Xbox. I'll see if I could pull that up and download it if it's still around. I thought that was pretty cool. Um, I still would like to try out this Dame, but he's so expensive still. But I just don't think he's worth it compared to, you know, I got D-Rose here. And then I got Curry here. And then Parker. And then Baron. Nah, Baron's not that great. I got Luca, of course. Magic. Jamal. Look at my Jamal with his Hall of Fame clamps, Intimidator, and Tireless. Mm. Westbrook, I mean Westbrook, and then my dame is short on badges compared to him, but the stats are the same, you know, give or take. So, I don't know. Let's uh, we'll see how this goes. Uh, I'd like to get Kermit. I'd like to get Kermit. Avon, do you feel like Kermit does a lot for you, or do you feel like he's just there?
Everybody's messaging me because I know I'm a nugget homer. Yeah, I'm kind of buzzed about this trade, man. I'm curious what's going to happen with the Nuggets now, if that's what we needed to do. Anyways, I um, really, really am thankful for you guys coming out and being part of my stream, man. This is, this is awesome having you guys around and having support. <clears throat> Give a shout out if you're in the chat. Let me know you're there. We got Nightbot running and and gunning and um, you know we'll see see how this goes here. You know, I didn't think I'd ever do a channel and stream. My Ogato, I can't. It can't get here soon enough. Cannot get here soon enough. So. The other thing I was going to tell you guys was uh, that I made a promise to make part of this video is, you know, season six, prepping for season six. So, I mean, if you guys got high end cards that you're not going to want to keep. So some people may not keep their, <clears throat> you know, MJ or Luca or Harden or Jokic or Garnett. I mean, I think you're crazy if you get rid of it, but everybody's got a different plan, different way of doing things. So if you have a big rewards lineup like this. I got a pretty big rewards lineup here. So like if I sold all my cards that aren't locked in, I'm doing okay still. Like look at this lineup. I got Hondo I, I locked for, but I got Ray Allen, I got McHale, uh the Sigma's not bad. Um who else was out there that I was looking at that I could roll in on this? I mean I got I got at least half a dozen, you know, good good cards out there that I could roll in on this. There was there were some other, I, I got uh, Drexler, you know, I could throw Drexler in, in, in place of Hondo or or Tyler Hero here, you know, um, just to give you guys all some different looks here. There's Drex, um, I got Don Ohl. Um I made some like builders, you know, like one had uh, Colin Sexton in it, um, Ben Wallace, I mean I could put Ben Wallace in here for Moses Malone, but I doubt that, I think. Mm, let's compare them real quick. They're actually kind of close, but I think Ben Wall's gonna be a way better shooter. Excuse me, shooter. You know, and then of course there's budge options like Cat and Draymond, still running around that you can use to get by on, right? Like if I wanted to get by, <clears throat> um, these are some of the cards that I could use. I feel like Moses Malone is a much superior card, though. I also put the Kobe Grinches on him, so he's got his ball handle boosted and. Even though the defense is a little better out of Ben, um, I don't know. It's it's a it's a close thing. Um, defense perimeter defense is probably better with with Ben here. Let's see what the tendencies are. That's my only complaint about this Ben Wallace car, by the way. The Tendos. Yeah, look at look at Mosey. More Tendo glitched. What's his strength? His strength is a 98. I don't know why he gets kind of bullied around by bigger bigger uh, centers. So I tend to play Moses Malone at the four, and he's got some excellent badges as you can see. And I think he's got some excellent defensive badges too. Yeah, rim protector, box clamps, heart crusher, interceptor, intimidator, moving truck, rebound. Yeah, I mean, another another no money spent option is Moses Malone, right? So, um, Jack's, Jack's a, a tough card too. I like Jack. But do I replace Jack? Jack can shoot that three ball. So that's why I got Jack kind of sitting back there on my my rewards lineup if I was going, you know, no all, all of my no money spent, right? <clears throat> he's 6'11". 
He can do it all offensively. Defensively, interior, he's the man. He can rebound a little. He's slow, though. He's really slow. I really get down with Ben Wallace. I almost feel like Ben Wallace would suit me better in this lineup, to be to be honest. Um, and I was kind of playing around with these lineups a little bit to kind of see see what we had. Um, I like D-Rob here better. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think I'd put Moses Malone in here. And I think I'd put him here. You know, I think I'd kind of run around with that maybe. I don't know. There's a lot of different things I could do here. I think that's a really great budget lineup for somebody if they they needed to see one and see what grinding can, can do. I don't know if it's realistic to grind for all of that without spending some MT as well like I did. Um, but that's an option. Um, see, if I wanted to, you could sell off some cards. I... Mm, so here's my thoughts. I feel like we're going to get... I feel like we're going to get LeBron... I feel like we're going to get another KD. Um, we're going to get another AD potentially. Definitely getting a Kobe. I don't see us getting an MJ. I don't see us getting another Zion this season. Uh, definitely looking at a, a Dark Matter Magic. I think we'll see... We're going to see an Opal or Dark Matter Ray Allen. They've got this this guy here. they got plans for him. They put out two pinks. Think about it. There's that older pink diamond and this newer pink diamond. They've got plans for him. They've got plans for him because they don't they don't do that with multiple multiple cards of the same tier, even though they're improved and all. Um, who else? I think we'll see uh, Dark Matter Curry. I'm not necessarily saying that'll happen this season, but I do think it's going to be a season of Dark Matter cards. Um, Kobe for sure. Shaq. Um, yeah, we didn't get a Dark Matter Vince Carter. I you know I should probably sell him. What's he going for? Nah, his price went down. I could have sold him just days ago for like 200 KMT and bought him back, I bet, on the cheap. Paul George is another one I could probably uh, have sold and gotten back on the cheap. I would pick I'd pick up this Paul George. <clears throat> if you guys need somebody like that Paul George base, I would pick up this Paul George in a heartbeat. He's a great card. I just have too many. When I look at my lineup, I just have too many cards. I should probably sell off. I should probably sell off Paul George and um, um, Vince Carter there, because I'm not going to use them. Um, Lonzo, though, who would I put in place? So here, let's do this so I can see what my options are better. Hang on. This card just is up and down for me. Um, no. He's dated. He's too small. I mean, we talked about that, huh, Yvonne? He's just too small. Um, D'Lo has got a good size, but I will take Lonzo any day of the week over this, this D'Lo card. I just would, yeah. Sorry, D'Lo. D'Lo's a great card, though. That's another, another budget card. Too small. I love AI, but too small. He's not going to play the defense I need. The rest of these cards are just kind of dated, right? Like, old, old. Old. Was never good. Um, old now dated. Mm. Curry slide. He's just a budget beast. Um, but he's getting dated as a budget beast. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, there's really nothing there that I could put in. So now I'm back here. I mean, D Rose. D Rose is phenomenal. But he's six three. Magic. I need magic with clamps. Russell Westbrook can play a little bit of defense. He can play some defense, and he's 6'4". Hang on a second. Let's check out some things. He can dunk. He can run. His defense just isn't there, though. Lonzo's going to play way better defense. Even though he has the right badges, he's just not going to play defense like I need. Um, Donald. Something's missing. Something's just missing with some of these cars. I don't know what it is. Jeremy Lin's another one. Something's just kind of missing. I haven't put a defensive Kobe uh, Grinch shoe on him. Um, and that just was, was a little off there, so I don't know. Um, yeah, just not, just not sure there. Um, Nash is cool, but no. Big O is cool, but no. France is cool, but no. A lot of people like Kyrie. I love his defense, believe it or not, but I cannot shoot with him the same way. I don't know what my deal is. 
I should be able to cook with this Uncle Drew. Uncle Drew's one of my favorite players, too. Um, Sexton's pretty good, but no defense compared to the other guys, right? It's Darren Fox can play some decent defense. Hmm. But he's small, he's lean, and he's only 6'3". So my conundrum is, see why I keep going back to him. What I really need to do is unlock John Wall. I unlock John Wall. John Wall goes into Lonzo's spot for sure, right? And then, and then it's conversation. The other conversation is, you know, magic. I mean, I should have magic in this lineup. Magic's got all the size. Magic can shoot a little. They'd get his release down. It'd be nice. You know what I'm saying? Does he have wrenches on? Hold on. No, he's got a Air Jordan. I don't think he can get the Kobe shoes, can he? Um, he rebounds like crazy. He's not quite fast enough, though. Yeah, he does that weird, like, limp up the court thing. I don't know. I'd love to find one, though, that had Hall of Fame um, clamps, though. And and I for a while I had found um a Pantheon one that did. But man, people were bidding all kinds of crazy on it. Um Yeah, people were bidding all kinds of crazy on that, but I would love to find a clamped up Hoff clamp, Hoff range, Magic Johnson. So this one's even got some Kobe's on him. Which Kobe's is the guy? He's got the shooting Kobe's. What does he have for extra? Lob City finisher. Really? That's extra badge you decided to throw him? No thanks. What's this one got for an extra badge? Love that deep hooks. Mm. That is not the droid I'm looking for, so I don't know. I but I just don't really want to spend that kind of MT too, you know what I'm saying? Like it gets pretty it gets pretty wild with the MT. Mm. Let's see what this one did here. Lob City Passer. Yeah, that's not that's not the one. People just go all out for it too. It's really annoying. Nope, no Hoff clamps for range. Yeah, see, I don't know. That that'd be the ticket for me is Hoff clamps, Hoff range, at least Hoff clamps. I get Hoff clamps on him or Hoff clamps on Luca. That would be that'd be the hot ticket. I'm looking at these ones because they should be cheaper. But really, what I ought to do to save the most MT is just find a hero one and swap it. That's probably what I should do. I'm just afraid the hero one will be so expensive. Um. I think 32 is a stock badge count. So we got to go all the way up. Nope. Nothing there. Hold on. Let's go to Hero Luca. So what's my stock badge count? 26. Okay. So all I do is I just come look at the ones I have. 20. This one has 27. How much time is left? Five minutes. Okay. Let's see what he's got. I don't think he's going to have the badges that I'm looking for, though. Deep Hooks, get out of here with that. I mean, I shouldn't say get out of here with that. Deep Hooks is actually decent. I don't think I'd swap for it, though. Hmm. So 
It's actually one of 29 Hall of Fame badges sitting over there too. We're gonna check on check on that one next. Hmm. Heart Crusher, that's not a bad badge, but that's not what we're looking for. This one has a lot. So it's got Flashy Passer, that's unnecessary, but okay. Rim Protector, alright. Clamps. Here we go. Now we're talking. He's got clamps. Mmm. Rim Protector and clamps. Alright, let's keep this one in mind. And he's got, uh... Diamond contract, diamond shoes, so alright, alright. That one's gonna go for a lot of MT though, and I'm streaming about it here. This one has 33? 33 Hall of Fame badges? What did they do? What you doing, baby? Like Danru. It's like a Danru. Yeah, Clippers trying to trade for that Kyle Lowry. That's a good trade for them. That's a good trade for them if they can get him. This one here, so he's got post spin. Yeah, I could use that. Tireless Defender. Okay. Trapper. Okay. Worm. Okay. Cross Key Scorer. Okay. Giant Slayer. Okay. I mean, that's that's pretty tight, too, to be honest. I mean, mm, that one's in the running, but I feel like the clamps is where it's at over here on that one so we'll come back got a few hours to decide i'll let you all know in another video if i end up pulling the trigger on one of these this one's intriguing this is intriguing with that post spin technician mm. tireless defender and trapper the worm cross key scorer Giant Slayer. Mm. It's got Green Machine too, huh? Oof. Oof. If this one had clamps, or if I had Hall of Fame clamps sitting somewhere, that'd be the one to try to get after. But look at that, he's seven and a half hours away. They're going for big MT on that one. Seven half for knows what. That'd be like seven tonight, mountain, nine eastern. Be about the right time. This one here though. I have to see how this goes. But I like that rim protector and clamps. That's mm. Mm, do I bid? Should I bid on this one? I don't know. I think I should say my MT because you know they're going to give us a Luca that has clamps already and he's going to be juiced in some other ways. So I shouldn't get too excited. Unless, of course, I'm going to redeem the coach, but we're not going to. I've decided not to do that right now. We're going to wait and see. But yeah, that's that's some options for you. You guys could try selling some of your top top cards and running you know, a budget reward, reward lineup if you have something you know, similar to mine that will get you by, you can compete with. That's cool. There's nothing wrong with that, keeping yourself liquid. Me, though, I play in a lot of tournaments, so I'm going to keep the big dogs. I'm going to keep the big dogs and bust out the Hall of Fame credit card and buy some more VC and pull some more packs. <laughs> so that's how that's going to go. Um, Yeah, yeah, that's how that's going to go. Anyways, my thoughts are don't lock for the coach yet. I have a feeling we're going to see more coaches. The glitch scenario is going to be big. Is it going to be Ben? Is it going to be Giannis? Is it going to be both? Who's the lo the reward? Some people are saying Jalen Rose for the limited. I I could see that. I could also see them doing you know somebody else uh, for the limited. Um, you know I could see an out of position uh, Dennis Rodman. I could see an out of position because we we really haven't gotten a big Dennis Rodman card yet, right? I could see an Opal Dennis Rodman. But they've already given out what? They gave out Paul Pierce, then they did Patrick Ewing, then they did Iguodala, then they did uh, 
you know, uh, McHale, then they did Maxwell. We are due for a point guard, I think, out of out of the unlimited. As far as limited goes, they've given us some variety. Maybe we'll get a two guard out of the limited. I, I see us getting more of a two, you know, maybe someone a little more obscure. We'll see. Uh, we'll see what they come up with. But I, I would not be buying anything right now unless it's super cheap. Things are only going to go down in price. Um, that's that's my opinion. Um, but yeah, guys, I was going to see if there's somebody else out there. Because i got to go for a bit. I'm going to stream again later, though. But i got to go for a little bit. You guys like some Call of Duty? Um, you know, I was going to see what we could do to get to know some people and to, to help out a little bit. Um, but yeah, let me let me see something here. Hmm. 